Ace Money the name, getting paid for the game. My goal is to help you get that money by sharing my picks as well as some useful knowledge and betting techniques. Now, while we go over this recap, I'd like to get right into these picks so we can get in and out like a BE with handicappers. So it's a SBR, Sportsbook Robbery. I'm Ace Money, and this is Sportsbook Robbery. It's for our WNBA Sunday 29th. We've got uh, two games, the final four. Aces at Liberty. Uh, open at plus four. Over under 163. Uh, Aces as the dog, plus 154. Uh, basically stayed the same. Four, four and a half. You can find it at over under 163. And then... Uh, yeah, still plus 150, minus 180. You know, kind of big favorites, both games. Second game, I think it's at 8.30. We got Sun, uh, Suns, Connecticut Suns at Minnesota Lynx. Open up at plus 5, uh, 154 and a half, and uh, plus 180 is the Dogs, the Suns. Basically stayed the same as you see, 4, 4.5, 155. Uh, odds went down a little bit for the money line, plus 180, once, I mean 170. And then uh, big favorite, 192, 205, 210, both of them. 180, 195. Uh, they're probably right. I feel like they're going to be the teams that win. You know, being a New Yorker. Hope my uh, Liberty get a uh, redemption from last year. But let's get into these player props. First up, Kelsey Plum, points over 16 and a half, even money. Uh, DraftKings, FanDuel got a minus 113. So, will we say this? If you're going to do this, you need multiple books, and you need to line shop, and you need to odd shop. Because every book has different odds and lines. And... You know, you got to find the best lines. Uh, Liberty overall, third in points. Did pretty good this year. First uh, number one seed. But, uh, every time Kelsey Plum plays them, she does pretty well. Uh, three of the last five games, she's cleared this. I mean, she did horrible on the 22nd. First game of Seattle. Uh, she's exceeded 16 and a half in four of the last five games on the road, averaging 20 points. With this outlier site, I could break that down, actually show you that. Just go to away games, four of the last five away. One of them was versus Liberty on the eighth at 25. Head to head. Uh, just this year, I only played three times. She cleared it twice, 22, 13, 25. Every time she plays them, she does well. Uh, it could be a lot, of, a lot of people, no matter what sport it is, you get to that, that New York line right, and they play better. For the year, 63% hit rate for this number. Uh, for the year, shooting 43% from the field, 36 from threes, 84 from uh, stripe, foul line. But, uh, yeah, so let's get it. Kelsey Plum. Richard Carlton. I went with points over nine and a half. Uh, minus 118. Vandal. Playing Connecticut, uh, Connecticut's number one in a lot of things. Points allowed, uh, assists, bunch of shit. But um, if you've been watching, you know we've been playing her threes forever. I decided to just go with her points to start it off. Uh, and then I think if she's going to get her... They got threes at two and a half. Uh, I think they brought it down to plus 120. And I'm like, oh, if she makes a point, she'll probably make her threes. But she don't always shoot just threes. But it's for the year, shooting 47% from the field, 45 from threes, 82 from the foul line. 
Um, just these last three games, we'll do four, three, four attempts, five attempts, six attempts, threes. Field goals, four attempts, eight attempts, 11. So it does vary, but uh, I just wanted to save a route this time. Head to head. She's cleared this uh, two out of three. Not by much, but she goes over it. Uh, let's get it. Bridget Collin, nine and a half points. Let's go. Next up, I went with Mabry. Ball of Mabry. Money making Mabry. Uh, 14 and a half. All on the back, like always. Uh, minus 145. FanDuel. Uh, DraftKings. FanDuel got it at 152. Uh, what we got here? Head to head. Not too good, right? Played twice this year. One of them was with uh, Chicago. Connecticut. One game. She had a bad shooting game, I'm pretty sure, that day. 5 for 14. With our last five games. This was the end of the season. But uh, she turned it up. Turned it up versus Indiana, 27. She had 17. And uh, she should be starting... She's been coming off the bench, but either way, she's going to go over this. Uh, Harris's game time decision. She had a sprained ankle the other day. It's going to be a good game, but uh, definitely expect her to clear this. You know, that 15 and a half, 16 and a half, you can get it. But I always hold line it back. I'm a big fan of that firm believer. You can get it at a lower number. Always get it at a lower number. Uh, for the year, 57% hit rate. That's 20, 70%. Yeah, hopefully uh, Money Making Mary continues to make us some money. Uh, her threes are always a good look, too. Two and a half, minus 140. But uh, just decide to go with the points, especially if she's starting. I mean, regardless, she almost played the whole game last game. I think the last two games. So that amount of minutes on the floor, it was last game. She played 39 minutes. But they're definitely going to use her. She's going to uh, be productive, all around productive, rebounds, assists, points. Uh, I just decided to go with the points. And like I said, I outlined it 14 and a half. Let's get it. Points over 12 and a half. 125 minus 125 DraftKings. Uh, you know, we're down to the nitty gritty and Key players are just going to step up. They're going to do what they have to do to win. No matter what it is, they're going to play hard. Uh, and I expect her to get over 12 and a half points. Uh, she cleared this three out of the last five games. Uh, these last two are the playoffs, playing almost the whole games. But head-to-head, uh, -head. she cleared it every time they played, going back to last year. Uh, three times this year, she's cleared it 18, 13, and 18. So uh, obviously the importance of the game. She's going to play plenty of minutes, and uh, I expect her to go over it. So, yeah, let's get it. Listed Thomas points over 12 and a half. You hit that like button. New viewers, subscribe, and everyone turn on your notifications. Where you get all my plays, my live bets, anything I do, I try to be as transparent as possible. If you got any extra time, if you could leave a comment.
the uh, likes and comments just help get the videos out there as well as the comments for me it gives me some interaction uh it's like my payment it makes me uh feel like it's worth it uh thank you everyone all right so real quick i just did two little parlays on the special uh this one's a same game parlay plus 324 i did kayla mcbride 10 plus points Alyssa Thomas, 10 plus points. Uh, and Bridget Carlton, 10 plus points. And then I did Mabry, 2 plus threes. McBride, 2 plus threes. And Carlton, 2 plus threes. So uh, $25 pays out 106. And uh, all these people, all of them have been clearing these numbers. And uh, as well as the threes. So. You know, logically, it should be a good play. Uh, 25, payout 106. So let's get it. All right, and then I did a, a, same game, a same game plus. It's kind of the same thing. I did Mabry, 15 plus points. This one, I actually show you the odds. You see, minus 145. All them plays are like minus two, three hundreds. So I did the Mabry, and then I did uh, Eisenhuk, 15 plus points, Kelsey, Plum, 15 plus, John Quill Jones, 8 plus, and then Brianna Stewart, 15 plus. And I put them both together, and uh, what did it come to? Plus 329, uh, 25, page out 107. So yeah, let's get it. Uh, check out my NFL video. Look out for my other videos and videos and videos and the live bets. NFL tomorrow. Let's get it. Ace money the name. Getting paid for the game. Let's go.